What is good, Mama Squad, and welcome back to our channel. Today, I am all alone. Actually, this whole week, I'm all alone. Mariah left me, and I don't know what to do with myself. I'm freaking out, okay? I've never been home alone before. I know this might sound weird, but this girl has crossed the country, and I don't, I literally don't know what to do. Like, I'm, I'm cleaning. I'm literally folding her clothes for her and hanging them up. Like, who does that? What, what dude just starts cleaning because he's that bored. Like, see, if you live with someone, and this has to go with, like, if you live with your family too, you don't realize, like, everybody, like, distracts you throughout the day. Whether you're just watching TV or you're in your room alone, you have things and people and noises in the background, but, like, when nobody's here, dude, it's, like, a whole different world. Like, I don't even know, like, I spent last night alone. I dropped Mariah off at the airport yesterday, and that was, like, my first night alone. I don't think I've ever stayed at my house without Mariah here. And if Mariah wasn't here, I had, like, a friend here a guy friend okay not another girl okay i just want to clear that up real quick but this morning just feels so different like i usually don't make the bed like everything that you saw like i use i literally don't do any of that like i'm not like lying about my morning routine this is actually how my morning routine was today but i, I made the bed like yo i don't make the bed i never make the bed and for some reason today i want to make i'm like just super motivated to clean and to just do stuff around the house maybe because i want mariah to come back to like an awesome house if she comes back I hope she comes back. Baby, please come back. Okay. But Mariah went to Boston to visit Julia, one of her best friends, and she left me with all the cats and an empty, quiet house. Just listen, listen super quick. This is what I've been dealing with all day. Are you ready? Listen. At least at nighttime, outside, you have like crickets and stuff. It is so quiet in here. All I hear is like cat feet sometimes. Like that's that's the only thing. If I didn't have these cats, I'd literally go insane. I wouldn't know what to do. Like these three cats, they definitely keep the house more cozy. But at night, like it's so like not eerie, but it's just it's different. You know what I mean? Usually I have some girl squawk in my ear about something that she has a problem. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Mariah doesn't do that all the time. But today, I have a lot to do. I'm, I wanna, or, like, look, look at my closet. I already organized my closet. Like, I've never taken pride in doing this, but my side, super clean. I'm working on Mariah's side, okay? I have all of her shoes laid out. Our shoe storage is full, and our other shoe storage is full. So I don't know where to put all these, but we're gonna try to figure it out and make it look as best as we can because I have nothing else better to do, and it's a weekday, so everybody is at work, all my friends, so I can't even like play games with them or uh, call them. <laughs> <sighs> Wish me luck. Also, I, if you're wondering why I'm in the guest room, I'm not just cleaning it because Mariah left and I literally have nothing to do today. But if you didn't know, Megan and Jordan, Megan is Mariah's twin sister and Jordan is like my best friend. They're both coming down and they'll be here in two days, two days, three days. So I gotta get the guest room ready. This is where they're gonna stay, right here. And they're coming down for like the Halloween party that my sister's having. So I gotta get ready for them, which I'm super excited for. And I haven't seen them in forever. Okay, it's been a month. Okay, it feels like a longer time, okay? They're, they're in Chicago, I'm in Florida. So it's, it's definitely a lot different. Say hi to Scar. He's getting big. Oh, before I go in the shower, yo, I want to tell you all right now the giveaway that we did or that we're doing right now with the Apple Watches. If you didn't know, we're giving away three Apple Watch Series 9. So the brand new Apple Watches for hitting 3 million subscribers, which y'all, I still can't thank you enough. All your support has just been like overwhelmingly amazing and we appreciate it times a million. But the video that we just posted about doing our Halloween makeup, which I hope you guys enjoyed. We loved it. We thought it turned out amazing and I hope you guys thought it turned out amazing as well that was our trial makeup period that's exactly how we're gonna look like on the Halloween party night where Megan Jordan's coming but we are picking people from our that YouTube video that also you have to follow us on Instagram so make sure to watch that video comment down below on that YouTube video and then go over to our Instagrams and follow Mariah and I you can follow our couples channel too honestly the more that we see y'all engaging in our um, content and everything the more we're gonna obviously want to pick you and appreciate all the support across all of our platforms but we are doing that giveaway once Mariah gets home from 
from Boston. We are gonna be picking the winners and putting them in a YouTube video, like shouting them out and stuff, so you'll know exactly who is going to be sent a brand new Apple Watch. I don't even have the new Apple Watch. I want the new Apple Watch, Mariah does, but I have like the Series 3, so y'all are getting the Series 9. I'm actually kinda jealous. I just don't wanna, I don't know, I just I don't wanna like spend the money on Apple Watch because I already have one. It's like, I don't know, why buy another bed when you already have a bed? I don't know. But either way, we are gonna be doing that in a couple days, so stay tuned. Make sure to be following along with our channel because it could be anywhere in the next recent videos that we post. Whenever Mariah gets back, like I said, we're going to be picking the freaking winners, and I'm so hyped to give them away. By the way, before I hop in the shower, I wanted to show you guys another thing that I've cleaned. Welcome back to things that Bill has cleaned today because I don't know what else to do with myself. Look at how many towels we have. I swear whenever Mariah is here, we have nothing. We literally might have like this much right here. She goes through like three towels a day. I don't know why. It's like one for her body, one for her hair, and then one just to like step on. She throws a brand new towel on the ground sometimes just to step on it. <laughs> and we have this mat too. We already have like a, a mat to like dry off on, but hey, I guess whatever works for her, works for her. But tell me she won't be excited when she sees this. I'm honestly doing all this so Mariah never leaves me again, okay? Wait, or is this gonna make her wanna leave? Cause I'm cleaning. I might be screwing myself actually. She might wanna leave more because I'm cleaning for her. I'm gonna stick with the first one. I think she's not gonna wanna leave anymore because she loves it so much. <laughs> hey Snap, how are you? Look at it, he's so cute. Hi, what are you doing? What's the goal? Oh, you wanna play with your toy? That's his sign that he wants to play with his toy. Look at it. Oh. Oh, oh, but then Scar comes in and ruins all the fun because he takes over and Snap doesn't want to play anymore. Scar, this is Snappy's toy. He loves it. <laughs> he loves it so much. He would do anything. And that's the thing. If we ever need to find Snap, it's so funny because like usually before we leave the house, we want to check to make sure all the cats are like good and well. We'll jingle his toy because, well now both of them come out, but it used to be Snap would just come out of wherever he's hiding, wherever they're sleeping. Cats can literally get into anywhere. So like y'all know, if y'all own cats or even small dogs sometimes do it they'll hide in like the most crammed smallest spots and you think that you literally lost your animals like half the day like we don't even know where half of them are <laughs> they're just sleeping behind the bed or under the bed or behind the couch or uh, anywhere if i look super sweaty too i just left the house for a couple hours so i own a airbnb and basically the sink broke and when i tell you it broke like it was spewing water everywhere and i had to go run over there and fix it because they couldn't use the sink and it was getting flooded. So I'm all sweaty now because the Florida heat is crazy, but we're back at it. I wanna finish chores before Mariah gets back. Now she comes back in like a day or two. She comes back in two days. And that is also when Megan and Jordan are coming over. So I wanna get the whole house ready. I have the guest bedroom sheets right here and I just finished washing her clothes. I've literally never washed Mariah's clothes in my life. And she has like 50,000 pairs of clothes. Okay, she takes up our closet. She takes up our bathroom closet where the towels are. She takes up her dresser, our guest bedroom dresser. She also takes up the guest bedroom closet. And why do I feel like I'm missing something? And then on top of just having clothes all over there, she has like 10 stacks of dirty clothes. Baby, I am so glad you left me because I could finally catch up on the clothes. I swear to God, there's always clothes on our floor. Like always, and I hate it and I wanna get out of that habit. I feel like one of those memes where it's like, oh, he's probably out cheating and, you know, hanging out and not wanting to be with you like when she's gone. But like in reality, I'm literally here doing chores and just like, I'm having fun. I'm not saying that I don't like doing chores, but it definitely like, I just want to sit down and like watch TV or something right now. <laughs> telling me that is not the cleanest stove top you've ever seen. And we cook on this every day. That's crazy. <laughs> Woo! 
work. I also went ahead and super glued our beautiful fall sign that usually sits right here. This guy right here, hey snap. You knocked it over, you were being naughty, and he was climbing up on top of the fridge, and this is the second time he broke it. I already fixed it once. It didn't just break in two pieces, it broke in three. How do you feel about yourself, huh? The life that you put us through. I'm just kidding. I love you. It's okay. Bomber Squad, I know I look rough right now. Today's just been a scramble. I literally have to take another shower because I sweat so much. But I'm about set for today. I mean, I have another day ahead that I can do stuff around the house. So I'm just gonna be cleaning and hanging out. But Mariah literally left me and it's so weird without her being here. Like I said, y'all don't understand. Like I haven't gone solo in a house, okay? Listen to this, since I was a kid. So it's not that I'm like scared or it's like nerve wracking but like it's just weird it's different and it's kind of lonely like shout out to y'all because I have some friends out there that live alone and I don't know how they do it I guess you might get used to it after a while but trust me like having someone there is like so much better and this makes me appreciate Mariah like so much more because like I don't know now that she's gone it's kind of weird like not having her here and like even though I don't know sometimes we butt heads and sometimes like you know you want your space and stuff like too much space sometimes is like you feel like they're never coming back like you feel like <laughs> she's never gonna come back but um, Mariah will be on a flight coming home in the next two days. I know, I'm, I'm still, my brain is like all over the place. As you can tell, just like this video, my brain is literally all over the place. But thank you all so much for watching this video. I'm so excited to do the Apple Watch giveaways. Y'all have no idea. Like, three Apple Watches for hitting three mil on YouTube. I can't wait. Like, let's see how fast we can get to four mil. I'm hoping by next year, I'm, next year is gonna be our four mil on YouTube. We're working really hard and we hope you all like love our content. Between like we love pranking each other between those videos We love doing like vlog type videos like these as well So if y'all have any like video ideas like challenges or vlogs like we love doing challenges We haven't done challenges in like forever Honestly, the last one that we did was like the shopping challenges and stuff But I feel like we should bring back some like challenge videos and like maybe some cool vlogs and stuff But don't worry like team bill has been I'm staying hot Okay, team bill has been pranking the living crap out of Mariah and if y'all want a funny video to watch We just posted a bedroom scare prank. I locked Mariah in the bedroom. She thought I wasn't home and I scared the living daylights out of her. She heard ghost sounds. There were cockroaches everywhere. Oh my gosh. They're fighting right now. Not fighting, but they're playing. That's how cats play. Snap is just super loud. But if you want a good laugh, make sure to go watch that video. I got all of it on camera and it is freaking hilarious. But thank y'all so much for watching. It was actually kind of nice talking with you guys the whole day. It kind of felt like I wasn't as alone today. Y'all are my family and it actually got me through the day like pretty, pretty happy. It like gave me a purpose to like do stuff today and I love that. So thank y'all so much for watching this video. Y'all the real ones. Thank you for watching all the way to the end if you made it this far and we will see you in the next video but until then, peace, love you guys.